Hello friends, welcome to Engineering Funda family. In this video, I will solve two very interesting problems based on Gauss's law of magnetic field. In my last two videos, I have explained Gauss's law of magnetic field and Maxwell's second equation. Based on that understanding, I will solve two problems. See Gauss's law for magnetic field that states that for enclosed surface, magnetic flux is zero. Magnetic flux is integration of magnetic field with respect to surface. For enclosed surface, magnetic flux is zero. That is Gauss's law for magnetic field. And based on that, we have Maxwell's second equation where integral form is this only. But if you observe point form, so that states that divergence of magnetic field that is zero. So using this understanding, I will explain two problems, right? So here in problem number one, what is given? The flux density at a point in space is given. One should know flux density that is magnetic field only, right? There is no difference in between magnetic flux density and magnetic field, both are same. So magnetic field that is given to us and we need to find value of constant K. So here in this equation, constant K that we need to find. And to calculate this, we can apply Maxwell's second equation with differential form. So as per Maxwell's second equation, we can identify constant K. See Maxwell's second equation in point form, that is divergence of magnetic field that is zero. What is divergence? Divergence is del by del x of x component of magnetic field that is bx plus del by del y of y component of magnetic field that is by plus del by del z of z component of magnetic field that is bz that is equals to zero. Now here we need to do partial differentiation of x component. So here x component that is 4x. If you do partial differentiation of 4x with respect to x, then 4 is constant and x partial differentiation is 1. So this will be 4 plus partial differentiation of y component with respect to y. Here y component is 2ky. So partial differentiation of this is 2k and partial differentiation of y is 1 plus partial differentiation of z component with respect to z. Here z component is 8, 8 is constant, so constant differentiation is 0, right. So here, see this value of k, that is minus 4 by 2, means it is minus 2. So correct option for this question is minus 2, right. So that is how simply we can find constant based on magnetic field equation, right. Now I will explain second problem of this video. See in second problem, the following four vector fields are given in Cartesian coordinate system. Here we have four different vector fields that is given in Cartesian coordinates. The vector field does not satisfy the property of magnetic flux density is, so which field is not satisfying the condition of magnetic flux density, means which field is not satisfying the condition of magnetic field, right means here we need to apply Maxwell's second equation in point form. So as per Maxwell's second equation in point form, we can say divergence of magnetic field that is zero. So what is divergence? Divergence is del by del x of x component of magnetic field plus del by del y of y component of magnetic field plus del by del z of z component of magnetic field that is zero. So this condition that we need to check for equation A, B, C and D. So let us check it as per the data which is given to us. So if you do partial differentiation of y square with respect to x that is zero. If you do partial differentiation of z square with respect to y that is zero. If you do partial differentiation of x square with respect to z that is also zero. So this equation is satisfying the condition, right? 
that is resulting into zero over here as per divergence of magnetic field is equals to zero right let us check it for second equation so here see we have x component so partial differentiation of z square with respect to x that is zero partial differentiation of x square with respect to y that is also zero and partial differentiation of y square with respect to z that is also zero so this is also resulting into zero as per divergence of magnetic field is equals to zero so this is also satisfying the condition now here with this equation partial differentiation of x square with respect to x that is 2x right with this partial differentiation is 2x with this partial differentiation of y square with respect to y that is 2y and with this partial differentiation of z square with respect to z that is 2z so this is not resulting into zero right still we need to check for equation d see y square z square that is x component so if you do partial differentiation of this with respect to x then here we don't have anything with respect to x so that is zero here we don't have anything with respect to y so this is also zero and here we don't have anything with respect to z so this is also zero so this equation is also satisfying the condition so option c that is not satisfying the property of magnetic flux density so correct option over here is option c so that is how one can check for the condition right i hope now you are having fair enough idea about how to use equations based on maxwell second equation and gauss's law for magnetic field still if you have any query just post that in comment section i'll be happy to help you thank you so much for watching this video